she is a person of uh, just uncorruptible inter integrity and what people what people expect of public employees of public servants and it's great to to work with her. I'm Judge Bill's judicial assistant and I pretty much do whatever Judge Bill's needs for me to do. I, anything that Judge Bill's needs me to do, that's what I do. I think right after last year's Employee of the Year, I decided that when it came up again, I would nominate Tammy. The things that stand out about Tammy is, is her willingness to work through a project until the end. The Employee of the Year program actually started back in 2006. At that time, it was put together as an opportunity to recognize good performance of employees. Well, Tammy's like the dean of Judgeville staff because she's the most experienced. She started in magistrate court when she was 20, so she knows how the judicial system should work and how to run a courthouse, so her, her knowledge and her experience. We want county employees to understand that their efforts on a daily basis actually count. I know if I ask her to do something, she'll do it. She'll go far beyond what I actually asked her to do. Okay, I started working in Gwinnett County in 1989, December of 1989, and I started in the Magistrate Court Division, and I began um, handling all the dispository, civil suits, bad check citations, anything that came to the front counter, that's what I handled. The day that the application was due, I had printer trouble, and so I was running around the office trying to print, and so I was able to print it and, and hand walk it over to HR, but then it later came out on the copier. And I think she saw it, but another friend was here and he kind of grabbed it from her. So I think she knew something was up, but she didn't know for sure. She's an individual that uh, when, you, when you hear that she wins it, you go good for her. Uh, she truly deserves it. And it was really funny because we were in the auditorium and we were waiting for her to, um, for the award. And she said, um, I don't see anybody else that was uh, nominated. And we kept saying things like, well, they'll be here. Because she was really, you know, she was kind of nervous. But we knew that she was going to win and she deserved it. She truly wants to put out a product that is uh, of worthy, that represents the office, represents the task force, and represents Judge Bills. And so she definitely is determined to go the extra mile to make the product uh, one that has integrity to it. Tammy is the most reliable person, whether it's in work or anything else. You know that if she's committed to it, she's going to be there and it's going to be done the best to her ability. Tammy is a very organized person. She's very creative. She works well with the community. And when everybody comes into our office, she's very sweet to them. She's friendly. And um, she's a great person. Tammy is one of the most professional person uh, here at the courthouse. Any person that comes into contact with us, our office, the courthouse. So I think she's a great face for the courthouse. Always say something to her and at the end we'll say things like, because you are the employee of the year. <laughs> I already pick on Tammy a lot. I love to aggravate Tammy, but now I have something else to have on her. Uh, now that she is the employee of the year, uh, the standards have gone up. And let's just say I love to rag her and say, you know what? You got to do it. The standards are higher. You are the employer of the year. She got teased. I mean, we, we enjoyed the fact that, that she had won, but we were happy for her and we were just teasing her. Uh, whenever she'll say, ask me why I didn't do something a certain way, I'll always say, well, Tammy, that's why you're the employee of the year and I'm not. Citation, because they were always using the wrong date. Now they can put this in their pocket or put it on their visor and they always have a court date available for them. We've divided it up into shifts too. The sheriff's office is divided into shifts as to what court date they'll use. Three dates a month. How cool is that? 